need to pick shopping channel. That's right, guys. We're back again, episode three of Kitchen Gadgets, where essentially I found more random items for your kitchen that are probably highly unnecessary, but it's worth giving them a try. Or at least I'm going to do that for you so you don't spend your money unnecessarily, willy-nilly, and all that jazz. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then make sure you hit the eye just up here where you can see my Kitchen Gadgets playlist thus far. First up, we have the pretty unlabeled Blue Beach Banana, what genuinely says slutter, <laughs> peeler, chopper, item, new, fresh out the package. What does this do? Questions just come from the back. Do you peel it first? Of which another answer came from the back. A very good response of probably, because otherwise you've got lots of individual segments. <laughs> peel it. Line up your banana. Is it supposed to fit every banana shape? I'm going to go. It didn't take too much strength. It's not gone. Oh, I'm getting like bits at a time. Am I supposed to just push the rest through? I mean, really, what's going to be easier to clean is what that boils down to me as a 26-year-old who's forever wanting their own house. That's what I'm always questioning. <gasps> There's another delivery! Huzzah! Yeah! Another gadget! Right, well, screw you, banana. You are rubbish. It does its function. It's highly unnecessary. Works actually worse than a knife. And I just think that's going to be a devil to clean. A devil. I give this a Katie Picks 4 out of 10. Why? Because, I mean, I just really have no use for it. A knife works better. <laughs> the Good Grips 3-in-1 Avocado Slicer. Tranche Avocado 3-on-1. Cotador de Agotares. 3-on-1 Avocado Schneider. Split, hit and slice. This feels quality. So supposedly, I need no other tools. I won't lob this one. Slice. <gasps> I mean, that was easy. That was easy and satisfying. As is tradition with an avocado, we turn. Okay, this is our pitter. Push it on. Pull it off. Oh. <laughs> Push it on. Pull it out. Ah, I knew it. I didn't want this to fail. And then, what's even better is you have a handy hole. Think about it. Do you put your finger in and pop out the next step and final step? You have a ready-made segmenter thing for your avocado that you just place at the top and supposedly slice down. <laughs> Maybe it's not ripe enough. Don't fail. No! <laughs> it's a firm avocado, everyone. It's not a fair trial. Frankly, I'm giving this a Katie Picks. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 because I am. Don't give me that look, everyone. I am because I have belief in this product. 7, 6, 5. You can't. You can't pair it to the banana. Chef Reno, the German food lover, brings you squeezy Egelbentrenner lustig albla. I mean, I guess it translates to fish eggs. Ooh, that's not quite what I meant, people. What we've got here are basically. <coughs> oh my god! What we've got here are essentially suction eggs. What? No, suction fish. Why? because they're used to separate your eggs. So when you want just the yolk, and no, I'm not yolking. This is a cracking one. Excellent. Squeeze to create a vacuum. Place above your yolk, and then you release. <gasps> oh, I don't think I lifted it up quick enough. Come on, redeem it. I think that, I mean, that has worked. <laughs> So just plop it out. <laughs> <laughs> I mean that has worked. I give this fish 
a swimmingly good eight out of 10. Relatively successful. Right, here we go. It is the Moo Moo Milk Mix. I'm not gonna lie, I this isn't what I thought it was when I purchased it. The lid comes with a, a fun and endlessly entertaining pumping action. Oh! So we basically shake the cow's head up and down. Who's the guy, Rick, who keeps creating GIFs of all my stuff? Do not touch this video. What's the scores on the doors? I'm giving this a Katie Picks 9 out of 10. Yeah, screw you. I love it. I want it. It's mine. Next up, Culinario Pizza Cut. Basically, gigantic scissors to cut your pizza because sometimes a knife is just boring. <laughs> 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 Okay, here it is, people. That utensil you've always hoped <laughs> to have. A slight assembly required. Very minimal, though. I shouldn't be able to screw this up too badly. There we have it. Approach it. Cut it. I mean, ease of cut there. Cut yourself another bit. Now, that's not something I thought I needed in my life, but I'm pretty chuffed that I now have them. This pizza is so cold. <laughs> well, this is good. I'm very emotional and passionate about this product. Oh, it's a 10 out of 10. So there you have it, guys. Another truly successful kitchen gadget. If you like this video, please do not forget to give it a thumbs up. That would be great. It tells me that you enjoyed it, and I'll do it again if you fancy it. If you like this video and you want to see more, then please feel free to subscribe, and welcome to the family. We're here every single Tuesday, and I vlog on a Friday, and I'd love to see you there. Anyway, take care. Have a great day. Oh, God, my kitchen just got a whole lot better.